So we've got Mr. Woodrow coming outside in his um, smaller enclosure um, to start getting used to coming outside a bit. So I'm uh, just doing my kangaroo poo pickup. And um, so while I'm doing that and I'm around the area where I can watch him, he'll just start spending a few minutes, well, not a few minutes, sorry, maybe half an hour, an hour in his little um, pen here, getting used to it. And in a couple of months time, he'll be probably starting to live out here full time until he's big enough to go into his big enclosure. So, so yeah, so can you work out how to get in there? Come here, up here, Bubba. Look, there you go. We'll try. There's your beds in there, baby. There's your beds in there. Good boy. <laughs> so, yeah, so you just start to get used to this environment a little bit. Coming outside, and then we've got the kangaroos chilling out here. Hey, guys. So there's my trusty wheelbarrow, ready to pick up the poos. And, uh... A lot of them are wanting to stay in the back garden today and uh, chill out. It's uh, nice and protected down here from the wind. So, so there's Mr. Reefy Doofy there. And um, and for anybody who doesn't know, like I said, you'll see lots of videos of Rufus in the house. Um, but he spends all all the time outside with the other kangaroos, except for on an evening when he. He comes to the door asking to come in for a few hours, so we just let him because it keeps him happy and that's what he wants to do, where the rest of them are happy to just be kangaroos outside. Occasionally we'll have a few that will come in as well, um, but definitely not like Rufus who has done that ever since he was a little joey. He just, like I said, he comes to the door by his own choice and like I said, we just let him in because it's what he wants to do and it makes him happy. So, hello Bella. Hello Bella. So yeah, so all of these guys are chillaxing out here. There's little Tinkerbell laying down there, snuggling up to Gromit's uh, tail. And there's Christopher there. My shadow's in the way. Rhino. Rhino, you having a roll on your back, buddy? And big Gromit behind him. There. And then we've got Wilbur. The little euro there and here we got where's where's bubbalo there's bubbalo hey bubbalo how you doing buddy how are we we've got buddy in the background there and kaylee and fat ruby so yeah so these guys are all enjoying themselves out here in the sunshine and I have to try and work my way around them to clean up these poos. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm um, just thinking where little Willow is. She must be out in the paddock. So, she's out there somewhere. I'm just trying to look around to see her, but I can't see her. But yeah, anyway, these guys are all uh, enjoying sunning themselves in the back garden here. Um, and again, for anybody who doesn't know, they're not in the back garden. They've got this whole area out here, all up there and around, around the back up here. So they, they're not in a back garden. They're in a big enclosure area. And we've got Daisy laying over there. And there's little Miss Willow up on the hill. So there's Daisy. Hey Daisy, how are you baby girl? How are you baby girl? Hello Daisy, you sweetheart. And Willow. Willy, willy, willy -o. Hello, baby. You enjoying yourself up here? Hello, darling. How are we, Willow? Hey. How are we, darling? Hey, baby girl. How you doing? Hey, you gonna hold my hand? No? No? Little Miss Princess you are. And then we've got Ollie laying all the way over there. So yeah, so like I said, they're free to be out in this big area that they've got. Or like I said, it joins onto our, our back garden in the house. And um, the kangaroos, they uh, 
they love to lay in the back garden area. Um, they're, they're more sheltered from the wind out there. And they um, also too, they it's like they're safe zone. They feel really safe being close to the house. Um, and if they're in the paddock and anything out there scares them, they'll always run in here um, and feel a lot safer. So um, yeah, I call this area their, out, their big outdoor pouch. <laughs> Cause it's like I said, the safe zone. So yeah, so there's all the kids chilling, apart from the few that's outside. And uh, little Woodrow's gone in his bed by the looks of it.